If you're looking for a job in law enforcement, the Nueces County Sheriff's Office is in dire need of more officers. Despite his strong recruiting efforts, Sheriff J.C. Hooper says they still need more. Our Madeline Dart tells us where officers are needed and how it could ease the strain on existing employees. There's two brand new dorms at the Nueces County McKenzie Annex, but here's the thing. Both of them are completely empty because nobody is here to staff them. Sheriff Hooper says there's plenty of inmates to fill this room, but not without supervision. He needs 30 new officers and 11 to open up the new dorms. Just about every state jail in the state of Texas is about 10% short right now on their, on their staffing, and it's no different here in Nueces County. As of Wednesday morning, he says the jail is 91% full, which places a strain on the officers he does have. And it's a vicious cycle that leads to burnout, overwork, and uh, just all, it's problematic. Support officer Gary Thurman says opening these dorms would make a huge difference. Uh, very beneficial because we're pretty much 90%. This would knock us down. Sheriff Hooper has ramped up efforts to recruit new employees, but some of them have fallen short in the application process. So many of the people that come to us have, have issues with the drug screen or they have issues with criminal uh, activity in their past. He says while it is a challenging and demanding job, all of the training will be provided. You will have the tools, the equipment, and the skills you need to be a success here at the Nueces County Jail. For more information on applying with the Nueces County Sheriff's Office, you can head over to KTRIPLITV.com. Reporting from the McKenzie Annex, Madeline Dart, 3 News.